To recap, some kind of explosion, possibly a bomb, has destroyed a section of the George Washington Bridge. Some sort of car bomb. This wouldn't have happened if Henry Donovan hadn't given the Rangers IDs to the terrorists. We both know conventional methods won't get him to talk. We need to use enhanced interrogation. My people are already in position to pick up Henry and take him to a black site. I want your approval to activate them. Now we're going to learn what lengths Rebecca is prepared to go to, areas that people find very, very controversial. My husband will never go along with this. OK, what do you suggest we do? Stole him. Keep him from finding out what we're doing for as long as you can. Rebecca has decided she has to use enhanced interrogation methods, and she knows just the person to do it. Rebecca? You have approval to move on, Henry. <laughs> If we were going to bring a character into this new series from its last iteration, the answer was unanimously Tony Almeida, who had escaped prison after a bunch of terrible crimes. Go! Tony traveled the path from well-intentioned CTU agent to somebody who kind of lost everything he had in his life, and along with it, this sort of moral compass. Rebecca, good to see you. Tony. What we discover is that Tony has been doing black ops for Rebecca. Make sure you run all the preliminary medical on him before you begin. I don't want anything to go wrong. There's a strong tie between Tony and Rebecca. It's exciting to think that my character knows him well. That idea of taking Henry Donovan into enhanced interrogation puts a huge strain on the marriage. Does uh, John know this is happening? No. That's going to be an awkward conversation. Because of the circumstances, the personal, the political, the nature of the relationships all collide. What is this? What do you want? Just the truth, Mr. Donovan. What people have to remember is this is an accelerated situation. Thousands of lives are at stake. There's already been one disaster, and Rebecca really doesn't want something else to happen. Unless you come clean, we're going to inject you with a chemical. The first dose will feel like your skin is being burned away from your body. And trust me, it only goes downhill from there. It allows us to engage in a dialogue with the last version of 24's approach to interrogation and what you would do if there really was a ticking clock and a imminent attack. Now, I need you to tell me exactly how you two communicated. I have never been in communications with this Jadala person. Injecting that Tony character into this particular situation proves to be... Rocket fuel. You've released my father? We determined we'd gotten everything we could out of him. Why isn't he answering his phone? I really couldn't say. I also can't reach my wife. Somehow, I don't think this is a coincidence. I can have the attorney general here in 20 minutes. Do you want to have this conversation with him? We're very excited to have Carlos back. He always had this wonderful aura on the show as to whether he's good or bad. I went through all this at CTU. Well, this isn't CTU.